In this demo, we show how David will be able to use the planning app to start focusing on the next quarter. He gets a forward-looking view of the business forecasts and the AI-generated predictions for Q3. These AI prediction models will be driven by continuous clean data from the touchless processing of transactions. They are very granular and will make use of all available data, financial and operational, internal as well as external. The medical consumables business has predicted revenue shortfall here. He clicks on the related insights to explore this further. Gen AI has prepared a narrative and visual which shows there's an ongoing issue through the quarter. The narrative also guides him with some detail. The problem seems to be with a subset of the product categories. David uses Gen AI to dig into the category level renewal predictions. You're not looking at actuals here. These are detailed predictions from the multivariate AI models using both internal and external factors. PCR consumables is driving 85% of the predicted revenue gap in this case. On the left, you can see that Gen AI is also giving some pointers on related issues. David wants to explore correlated insights that shows the factors that might be related to this revenue shortfall. Oracle AI is at work. Oracle Gen AI provides details on two factors, internal supply issues affecting product output and a decrease in external demand due to a drop in COVID-related hospitalizations. These correlated insights are very powerful in helping finance users get the full picture, and they're very important in gaining their trust. With a much better understanding of the issue, David chats with his colleagues about adding this topic to the next sales and operations planning meeting, and he asks Gen AI to schedule a prep meeting for next week. In this section of the demo, you have seen how AI prediction models and Gen AI insights will give timely views on business outcomes and improve users' ability to course correct. That's the power of AI at work.